HAT series high flow oxygen therapy is suitable for patients with simultaneous breathing. It can provide effective treatment by providing a certain flow of heated and humidified oxygen air. These patients, including patients with humidification therapy, oxygen therapy, tracheal intubation, and tracheostomy, can now be used for life support. Take the main device out from the packaging box. LH2 heated tubing, power cord, water chamber, water chamber exchange connector, patient mode, low pressure air tube, user menu. Let's take a look at the main device. The left side of the machine is the display screen, and there are three buttons on the right side, which is the mute button, return button, and knob. On the machine left side, there are oxygen inlet and SD card holder. The back of the machine is the power supply base and the host lock. On the right side is the filter cover. There is a filter inside which needs to be replaced regularly. Remove the support frame from the water chamber. Connect the exchange connector. Open the water chamber cover. Press down and load the water chamber. Please pay attention to the direction of this chamber when loading and make a click sound to indicate that it has been loaded. Fix the water inlet pipe. Close the cover of the water chamber and insert the needle of the water inlet pipe into the injection hole under the water bag. It should be noted that a new water bag should be replaced before the water is used up. The duration of usage of the water bag is related to the flow rate. Connect the LH2 heated tubing to the connection port of the machine and make sure it is locked. Connect the end of the tubing to the nasal cannula. Connect the output end of the low pressure air tubing to the oxygen inlet of the high flow main device to ensure a frame connection and then connect the input end to the oxygen source. Please pay attention to distinguish and interface. Different interface, different standards can now be installed forcefully. First, insert the power cord into the power base and fix it with the lock of the host. Power on the machine and the screen lights up. The middle part of the main interface displays the monitoring value and the sighting value of the oxygen concentration, temperature, and flow rate, as well as the current mode and the SD card status. Data and the time are at the top. HAT series product support automatic oxygen mixing function from 21% to 100%. Target temperature supports from 29 Celsius to 37 Celsius, totally nine levels. The flow sighting range is 2 liter per minute to 80 liter per minute, and you can choose between high flow and low flow according to your needs. 2 liter per minute to 25 liter per minute can be set in low flow mode, and 15 liter per minute to 80 liter per minute is high flow mode. Sure, press the knob to enter the main menu settings. Taking the sighting of oxygen concentration as an example, when the cruiser is in the oxygen concentration area, short press the knob to enter the sighting state. Rotate to the new sighting value. Short press the knob to complete the modification. Rotate the back button or press the return key to come back to the home page. Next, set the parameters in the sighting interface. Rotate the knob to select the sighting interface. Take adjusting the humidity composition as an example. Select the humidity composition. Turn the knob to choose from minus 3 to 3. 
Sure, press the return key to come back to the main menu. Humidity composition can adjust the humidity without changing the temperature. When the patient feels that、uh, the humidity is insufficient, increase the gear number. When the humidity is too high or there is more condensation in the heated tubing, the gear number should be lower. The HAT series has a warm standby function. Select the warm standby function in the setting interface to adjust the switch of this function. After turning on, when the patient removes the nasal cannula, the oxygen concentration will drop to 21%. The flow rate will drop below 40 liter per minute, and in the same time, keep heating. After the patient continues to wear the nasal cannula, the normal working conditions will be resumed. The max duration for warm standby is 30 minutes, allowing treatment to be started quickly after a short lift, and reducing waiting time after turning on the machine again. Turn the knob to select the alarm interface, and short press the knob to enter. Low oxygen concentration and high oxygen concentration alarms can be set. The alarm log can be viewed for the past six alarm records. Which is convenient for the medical workers to learn more information. Start the device by long pressing the knob. After the device is turned on, it will enter the preheating state automatically. During the preheating, the machine runs at a flow rate no more than 40 liter per minute to prevent steam from spreading into the host. There will be a prompt after the preheating is completed. One thing to note here. Is that you must connect the heated tubing before turning on the device normally. After treatment is completed, long press the knob to turn off the machine. After the shutdown, the humidifier will be cooled down for 90 minutes to prevent moisture from returning to the host and cause damage. Continue press the knob can turn off the cool down system. Remove the heated tubing. Open the water chamber cover. Press down on the chamber and remove it. Caution: Do not touch the humidifier and the bottom plate of the water chamber when taking out to avoid burns. The water chamber uses a non-disinfecting one-way valve design, and the gas will not flow back to the host. Therefore, the host does not need to be disinfected. It can continue to use new consumables to save more time and improve efficiency. HAT series products can be used with Truly. There are three positioning holes on the bottom of the main machine. After aligning with the corresponding positions pins on the operating platform of the Truly, place the main device smoothly and tighten the lock nut under the operating platform to fix the main device. Compared with the conventional high flow oxygen therapy, the HAT series has made many upgrades and it is also very suitable. Not only that, BMC has developed two unique high flow modes by years of research in the field of ventilators: auto flow mode and smart flow mode. Auto flow mode is inspired by the auto CPAP mode of the sleep ventilator. It can detect the peak inspiratory flow rate of the patient, automatically adjust the output flow to meet the needs of the patient, simplify the sighting steps, have better treatment effects, and higher comfort. Smart flow mode is inspired by the ACE mode of the bi-level ventilator. Can follow the patient's every breath. Automatically switch the flow between breaths. Provide a higher flow when inhaling, a lower flow when exhaling, which is more comfortable while saving oxygen resources.